The Ring of Trials is a perfect place to make some cash. I've got a problem and you look at drain just a drain eye for a job. How can you tell my drain eye? I'm in a fucking tank. I know I'm going on about that, but that's just how badass it is. I'm in a tank. A trade shipment was supposed to arrive yesterday, but it's nowhere to be found. I'm running low merchandise here and I need someone to go out and find out what happened. If I were to guess, I'd say the Saber Honor is probably involved. Those brews have been a pain in her ass, in pain or, a pain in her side since we got here. So she needs Saber Maw in hurry, time is money. Decoying the competition. These Saber Honor freaks are, have cost me a lot of money, Paladin. I'm not one to forgive a debt and it's time to collect. The Saber Honor have been causing us the most trouble, or the ones living, Saber on that have been causing us the most trouble, are the ones living in Saber Maw. They keep ambushing our trade shipments along the road, she grins. It's time to decode the competition. Bring me their claws. We'll sell the best ones as good luck charms here at the arena. If the claw sales don't cover their debt, we'll just have to charge them an arm and a leg too. My god. Buy for me. 50G. 50 gold. <laughs> uh, can I be honest with you folks? I really don't know how to feel right now. Oh, tournament gear can only be used in war games. Ooh. I was like, wait, what? Great gear, like, what the fuck? Oh, messing way safari. Cool, these people again. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but if you come to join up with Nesting Way Safari, you're out, then you're out of luck. Safari's been put on hold while Hamlet Hem assists the Alliance and Horde in their fight against the War Song. Shame, really. This line is one of the most majestic and savage that I've ever laid eyes on. Our excavation biologist has been kidnapped by podlings who came to Niagara to explore the slated and mighty beasts and to test their metal along alongside the great Hammett nesting way. As soon as we arrived, the ne his nest uh, hunting prowess was needed to combat the war song, rather than sit twiddling our thumbs, we decided to continue the expedition, or exploring Spike Leaf Ticket when the Podlings ambushed us. Uh, during the chaos, ha Dr. Hadley Rickard was taken captive. Please, we can't just leave him there. Some Podlings, something needs to be done about the Podling menace in Spike Leaf Ticket. Along with Hem and Nessingway, I've hunted some of the, um, alongside him, sorry. I've hunted some of the largest and most terrifying beasts around. Never in my life have I encountered a creature as vile, depraved, or nefarious, nefarious or degenerate as a podling. The vicious little monsters spread themselves like weeds, as, and if something isn't done, they'll spread across the entire continent. Make your way in, into the Sprite Leaf Ticket and see as many podlings as you can find. I'll drop that for the moment. Alright. Let's have a look at the map. I've got quests everywhere. What's the ones up at the top? Well, that's to do with the podlings I just noticed here. And this one, the bonus objective. Kill 15 Sabron, their bone seer, and release 6 frightened spirits. Hm. I'll be back in just one second, folks. Hey folks, and I'm back. Uh, let's go deal with the quest down here. I'm, cu I'm curious about them. Absolutely. Boot followers. I hope I can because, like, I'm just kind of. Well, I'm 19 out of 20. I found the uh, horde stamp, uh, the horde place. I want to have a look of, into that one because remember how I got the ring there at Telar? The horde one may have a similar monument. Then again, maybe another part of Telar has it. Hmm. I suppose I could just wait and get the map. That was an option. Sorry, I just need to keep checking here. Hmm. 
Wait, what was that? Sorry, I thought I saw some some effect over to one side. Intruders, they're in attack. Let's try and attack them with a wood axe. Well done. Oh, okay. Kind of figured out there that they weren't actually trying to attack me, they were trying to run past me. Summoning Brazier. Hmm. Apparently, you can summon something here. Hyperius. Let's see what happens if I if I activate them all. I assume the summoning brazier, if you activate them all, it summons Hyper, 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 Hyperius. I swear I've seen that name before. Yep, here's Hyperius. Okay, let's get out of the tank. It's got a large hitbox, so I can hit it from anywhere. So, but it it doesn't, I'm not sure how well that works with the tank. Plus, I keep expecting I need to hit it where the model is rather than up at the tank's feet. Regardless, it's probably better to fight on my feet rather than in the tank. I know I said it. Okay. I got 12 garrison resources and a trinket that's not really good for me. You know, I could get the blessing to forge one. And, you, you know, the thing for my blacksmith. That might be nice. Also, you know the uh, quest, uh, the NPC here that I get as as a follower. I can't actually get them; Th they can mine. So, if I really wanted, I could boot away the miner I have and. Oh wait, never mind. It's done. Ah, here you are. Who are you? Don't you know death by sight, Paladin? When when they caught me in irons, the burning and blade instructor, um, keen eyes took my blade. He's an honorable orc, even if his training techniques are counterproductive. I want my blade back. If you want to know where your important piece of paper is, you'll have to return my blade or not at all. Wasn't that a quinky dink? The one orc I run into is the one I needed to kill. Heal. Nice. His blade. As sharp as a bla as sharp a blade as you've ever seen. A paladin, you've come to honor. All valor to die. It would appear that I have too. As a half drain, I half orc. My enemies within the burning blade cast me out when they rose to power, but my honor will not allow this to stand. Exiling me was an act of cowardice. They should have allowed me to fight for my place like any other. Now I will exact my vengeance from them at the tip of my blade. A blade master without a blade is no blade master at all. If you can defeat Lok, then perhaps there's some hope for you after all. With the without my honor, not without my honor. 
the blade is not the is not the only important item a blade master carries. When he passes his final test in the master's caverns, the blade master is given the honor of wearing the burning blade's banner. When my petition to rightfully claim my place within the clan fell upon death and craven ears, I was stripped of that honor. No, no doubt, my banner has been stored away in Hall Valor. They'll give it to some other aspiring blade master. They don't burn it first. Okay. Ah, uh, in the um, Outlands, he has that banner. Ooh, I could summon Hyperion again. Find him. And see what happens. Do I get garrison resources? He's an easy enough enemy to kill. I know I'm saying he, but it's a blob of fire, but mm, details. It just fights as an average enemy now. Trainee ran all the way over here just to run all the way back. It's done. Oh, immune. Catching fire. Apparently it's a big fan of Hunger Games movies. Thank you for dying. Ooh, apparently you can't loot a rare if you kill them the second time. Fascinating. If I go up there, I have to kill Big Pete, Loop, Lope, and Loop. I swear that's a reference to something. I won't say Outlands, but I'm not sure. Also, the Laughing Orc Clan rep. Laughing Skull Orc Rep Faction is only for Horde. I'm caught, caught it in passing on Wellpedia. Uh, opened uh, Firefox at some stage today. Hmm. This Blade Master is a bit out. Also, I'll have to get used to, again to fighting enemies. Don't die incredibly quickly. Well, this is a fuck ton of blades. It, it makes sense, it just seems like a fair bit. It makes sense, there's a good few, I mean, and there's, there's blades here, it just. Oh, well, there's a good few. And they all look a fair bit different to the swords they actually have. For some reason, he's kicking a stand with a blade on it. I'm just gonna leave him be to beat on that. Oh, well, he didn't have to come in here at all. We'll have to soon. Ooh, Overlord Trice Bloody Blade. Oh. I've seen him mentioned in patch notes. Apparently he bugs out and keeps evading. Or, well, used to. Good thing that doesn't fall down to the pit below. That would be awkward. No way back up. So, annoying. Apparently, the, they think I actually issued a challenge. All I did was walk over there. And walked away. I'm just going to choose to assume there's actually a player in there or something. That, and I just didn't notice them. Okay, where do I have to go? Banner. 
it's being stored away somewhere here. I haven't already burnt it. Let's try this hot. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's the hot he's in. It'd be awkward if he stored it in there, but who knows. Burning Blade Locker. Possibility it's in here, either that or it's loot. Also, you can get some leather hide uh, runts. This one's called them hunts for some reason, but I'm, I have no idea why. A, a pet one. Level 25, though, so better bring your good pets. Oh. The owner of this one has still has much to learn. Tattered Banner. Definitely not, not Lannisters. Uh, Flame Sear Summon Components. The contents are powdery, are powdery mixed with something that sparkles. And I got a bit of gold. What the? No idea. Kind of makes sense. It was in here, I suppose. I mean, the tra trainer is just outside. Invincibility. Ah, bloody hell. If only I could be my tank. Like seriously, if I could get into the tank, these would die without a problem. They would just be dead. I know I sound I'm going on about that, but it's just like the tank is fucking awesome. Not that one. A further look around, and I will do that that one that one bonus zone in my tank. As who the hell wouldn't hunt in a tank? Crazy people, that's who. Ooh, there's two chests in here. Few heels will be a good idea. Okay. Hmm. They have like half the health of the blade masters that were inside there. Makes sense, they were our only trainees. Blade Master's banner. It's cumbersome. I can't believe it doesn't affect the Blade Master's ability to fight. Maybe they're trained around it. Like, maybe maybe their training's done in such a way that, you know, it doesn't affect their ability to fight because they're, you know, used to it or whatever. Kind of like think soldiers have huge backpacks on. They're trained to be used to the weight and whatnot. Well, back, you know, supplies or whatever. Am I thinking right thing? Or, you know, their armor or whatever. They, they get used to it. They get trained on how to use it properly and whatnot. Maybe the same thing there. Mm hmm. Do you have my banner? I don't, I don't expect you to understand the importance of what you've done. Of what you've done. Perhaps one day you will. <laughs> 